Search and rescue teams spent more than 14 hours searching an area of Limington after 73-year-old Robert McDonough, who has dementia, disappeared Monday afternoon. Around 6 a.m., search teams were briefed and started to intensify their effort. It was going into the second operational period, which means we started to ramp up uh, using a lot of GPS technology. Well, again, we'd have our pilots, we'd have ATVs, canines. Just as News 8 was getting ready for our live update at 6.30, a gentleman walked up to our crew and identified himself to us as Bob McDonough. But you have, you have checked in with your wife and your, uh, and, and, um, your daughter and they know you're okay? After speaking with him for a few minutes, yeah, we, we then called the warden service, who along with a family member said that was in fact Bob. I'm Jerry, man. I've been looking for you for a while. You hurt or anything? He really was kind of, what, what's all the concern about? Didn't really even recognize the fact that, that we'd been searching for him. So, uh, real fortunate for us that he was able to come out. Wardens had hoped McDonough would be up and moving around when the sun came up and that either police or a passerby would spot him. Early mornings, really hoping that the sun brings him back to the road. And fortunately, he did. He brought him back to you. Aside from a little blood on his shirt and his hand, wardens say he was physically fine. Did you hear any of us or see any lights or anything last night? The search teams are trained to deal with cases of dementia and are happy Robert McDonough showed up safe and sound. You know, I, I've learned early on, I make no prediction on those and always assume that he's alive and well right till the end. So um, for us, good. In Lemington, Norm Carcos, WMTW News 8.